I want to talk to you a little bit about planting in the fall. Everybody thinks that spring is a time for planting, but fall is just as good, probably better. You have two seasons of cool weather. You have the fall and you have the spring. Roots will develop throughout the fall and throughout the spring. And generally the fall is moist enough and the spring usually brings enough rains. The weather's been a little weird lately, but you know what? I think we'll be fine. So in the fall you get some cool weather, you, get some, you generally get some moist weather in the late season. In the spring you get the same, you get some moist weather and then they're prepared, they're prepared for summer with good root systems and that will provide you a great plant. I'm gonna, this is an aster by the way, um, just an idea, this is a great plant for the fall. If you plant it early in the season, it'll come back. If you plant it, you put it in a planter and you wait till November, it doesn't have enough time to root, it won't come back. But I'm gonna show you a couple items and we're gonna get into some basic stuff. Here's a bowl of basically greens and herbs. This is a great idea for the fall. They can be planted in the fall, they can be harvested in November. You can pick at the bowl all you want. This is arugula. Arugula is a great, um, I guess, leafy green that's bitter. People put it on their pizza, they put it in their salads. Some people eat it raw, which I actually like to do. There's a couple other items here. There's garlic chives, it's blooming now for some inter interesting ornamental effect. Rosemary is a great plant. It'll go for a long time, even with a frost. It'll continue to grow. It's not going to die with the first frost. It'll last until we get a heavy freeze. At Copia, we do a lot of uh, fall vegetable crop planting. You can actually, we start seedlings here. You can plant these in the fall. It's, it's, most people think their vegetable garden is done in September. There's a new beginning. You can plant all your cool crops at that point. If you get them in the ground now, You'll still get an opportunity to get cabbage heads, leafy greens, kales, cabbages, what else, collards. You can do broccoli rabe, which I love, um, lettuce, Swiss chard. So there's a lot of things you can do in the fall. Don't give up. In mid-August, we were also doing cucumbers, squash for a second harvest. It is not over when the tomatoes are done. There's plenty of more time to grow great vegetables. With all these new programs, fall has always been a great time to plant perennials. Perennials can establish in the fall. You have to get them in the ground by late October. If you go until later than October, you, you still can get establishment, but it's not as good as putting them in the ground now and through October. Um, there's all sorts of stuff for the fall. There's, this is Echinacea, which is the cone flower. There are Sedum Autumn Joys, Heliopsis. You can grab plants that have been cut back. Roses are great to plant in the fall. So the season is not over. The fall is one of the better times to plant. And I invite you to come in and try and plant and enjoy the season. Thank you.